That was The Urge by Michael Sherry. Before that, we had Ghost Train by Seal Rodeo, and starting things off was Old Devil by Rosie Porter and the Neon Moons. You're listening to the New Music Alliance Radio Hour. Pretty groovy stuff. Pretty groovy stuff. I'd agree. Yeah. I would definitely agree. I love, you know, as a singer, I love Rosie's voice. I think she is. Mm. She truly has one of the more unique voices around, and I I think that she's the kind of artist that when you know her and you play her, it's like oh, that's her voice. You know, if you've oh, heard absolutely. it before. Absolutely, and like the tone of her whole compositional style, it just it it hits in the right place. You know. Um, yeah, well, Ro- Rosie's from. She's from Greenfield, Massachusetts, and uh, yeah, I I love I love that sort of like plaintive sound of, of her voice. It's just, mm. it's just perfect for the kind of music that she does. It's just perfect. Yeah, definitely. Mm. Then after that, we had a uh, ghost train by steel rodeo. I really like them. Very, very band esque. I would say. Very similar yeah, to the band. absolutely. The same thing. Kind of classic yeah. band sound. Mm. That's what I was thinking when I heard them. Absolutely in there. And it sounds yeah, really good. Yeah, that song to me sounds yeah you know, just like when you listen to the weight by the band. Mm-hmm. It's just mm-hmm. that same mm-hmm. that same feel to it. And uh, yeah, this is Eddie Seville, who's um, from the uh, sort of Waterbury and you know uh, Hartford, Connecticut area, mm-hmm. and uh, he's been playing. Uh, he plays by you know I guess him does his own stuff, and then he also does stuff with the full band Steel Rodeo. Yeah, that's wonderful. And then, of course, we had The Urge by Michael Sherry. Mm. Obviously, you have a uh, personal connection. Uh, yeah, just a, a little bit. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's my son, Mike. Is that God. <laughs> <laughs> but, but what I can say is that I, I, have, I have seen him live, and I have listened to him live, and he sounds exactly the same live as he sounds recorded. And to me, that means that your voice is, is terrific. Um, yeah. There's no fiddling around in the studio. And, and I'm going to say this, and, and this is in the, in like the biggest compliment that I can give. It, as as a, a child of the 80s, there's something sort of very classic kind of, you know, like an 80s riff going on underneath there, um, mm. like an 80s rock riff. Uh, I don't know if that's... Yeah, that chugging guitar work. Mm-hmm. So, Mark, what yeah. do we got next? Well, um, we've got some cool stuff coming up for our next block. Um, some, um, I guess, um, a little bit more, well, a little more experienced artists. Um, you've got uh, Dinosaur Jr. coming up. Of Liz course, Sayre, of course. And, uh, and then we have um, actually a new band um, called Lemon Street. All right, let's start things off with that Dinosaur Jr. track. Here's I Told Everyone. <laughs> 